What'd you see on that? Um, I was just guarding my my guy. I was trying to push him out of bounds so he couldn't uh, uh, be able to catch the ball. And then I was able to pick Pat, and I was able to just just make a play in the red zone and take away seven points. Were you surprised he threw it there? Was I surprised? I knew I would get a pick this game, but I mean, I guess I, guess I would say, um, yeah, I was I was kind of surprised, but I was in the mo living in the moment, like I knew I had to go make a play. What gave you the confidence yeah. that you'd get a pick this game? Uh, man, just ultimate belief in myself, and I knew my preparation. Like, just I just knew that you know I was gonna be able to make a play this game. We know you kept the ball last year, last week for the first one, and keeping this one too against a guy like Pat Mahomes. Uh, yeah, I did. Uh, I think I gave it to one of the. One of the equipment guys, so they can uh, paint it. But yeah, I think I am. Yeah, but to, you know, make a play like that against a guy that you know a lot of people refer to as a future Hall of Famer. How, right. how good does that feel? Is. He definitely is. I mean, it, I mean, it's it's a, a great moment. But I mean, he's just he's just next game, honestly. Yeah. Has it dawned on you how big a play that was? I mean, in a four-point win, taking away points right there. That you know, you could argue that's one of the big differences in the game. Yeah, I mean, yeah, but you know, it's I just it was next. I guess it's just next play. I mean, I guess it was a big play, but. You know, I was happy to take off seven points, but you know, in the red zone, on the other opposite side, I gotta be able to just uh, take that ball away as well because I was so close, and you know, I, I, that could have been number two. Was that a wave at the end too? Yeah, that was a little wave. <laughs> little bye. Kyrie, you've heard all about what it was like to be in this type of game in this stadium between these two teams. What was it like for you for the first time? Um, I really think this is our it was our biggest game because it was our next game. Um, I think every week we just want to go one, go one and zero and just improve just a little bit. I know for me, uh, I think it was really big that I, I could just keep striving, chipping away, and um, basically rebound from the last game. How good do you feel about the way the, the secondary played? I mean, you a lot of young guys in there. You know, you still rookie. Yeah, they got a few yards, but they only got 20 points. How good do you feel about the way you guys stepped up in this big game? <laughs> I mean, it's a blessing to be able to, you know, hold Pat to. I mean, how many touchdowns did you throw? One, one, two, I think. Two, one, two, two. I mean, I mean, it's a blessing just to be able to help contribute to the win. I think, I mean, it's obviously a lot of stuff we could clean up and, you know, um, uh, things we we wish we didn't do. But I think it's. I mean, it's always a, a positive for us to come out and get a win. I think team is the team win is should come first, and then we go back to the to the drawing board and just try to clean everything up. I know you already explained, but can you go through your interception for us? Yeah. So I was guarding my guy, and I was trying to force him out of bounds, so uh, he was wasn't able to you know come back in and establish himself and score. Um, then I just was able to peek Pat, and he uh, lobbed it up to I think a guy behind me. And I just jumped up. I tried to grab it with one hand and, and rip it away from the guy. That's why you do those high point drills, isn't it? Yeah, that's why I stay <laughs> after and catch all those balls.